Dada, I'm hungry. I want fruit salad. Gargi, seriously? You just said to do your homework and you are making excuses now to get up already. I'm hungry and anyways, these numbers aren't going anywhere in my head. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Nice. I'll quickly go to the shop to buy the fruits. Till then, you prepare the rest. Okay. Dada, I'm here. <laughs> do it quickly. Gargi, I'm doing it, okay? Okay, pass me two bananas and four apples from that bag. One, two, three. What are you doing exactly? What do you mean? You asked me to take a two bananas and four apples. So I'm taking them out and counting. Hmm. You know, Gargi, uh, from ancient times, humans have been counting things. In olden days, people used to use their fingers or markings on the wall for counting the animals they killed. So this counting thing na comes naturally to us. Uh, like one, two, three, four. Correct. So the conclusion is such numbers are grouped as counting numbers or natural numbers and its symbol is N. I know, it's in my book. Exactly. The bananas are over. There's nothing left in the bag anymore. Gargi, tell me how will you describe nothing? Dada, with a zero. No, but tell me, no? does zero belong to a set of natural numbers? Um, no. Actually, the set of natural numbers was not sufficient enough to describe nothing. So then zero was invented. Absolutely right. When zero was added to the set of natural numbers, we got a new set of numbers called as whole numbers. And its symbol is W. That means the set of whole numbers have all the characteristics present in the set of natural numbers and in addition had some more to represent the counting. So now can we say that all natural numbers are whole numbers? Yeah, of course. So does that mean that all whole numbers also are natural numbers? Certainly not. Because zero is a whole number, which is not included in the set of natural numbers. So, we can say that all natural numbers are whole numbers, but not all whole numbers are natural numbers. Hmm. Now it's your turn, Apples. Sasa, I forgot to tell you. Uh, when I went out to buy the fruits, I didn't have enough money. So, I asked Zoshi Kaka if I could give the remaining money tomorrow. And he said it would be okay. <laughs> It's all right. Okay, uh, then tell me how much amount of money you are left with. No, that's what I'm telling you. I was not left with any money. Instead, now I owe him 10 rupees. Okay, then if I ask you how much money you are left with, tell me how will you answer this question numerically? Mm, it's definitely not a natural number, but it's also not zero. We just need something more. Correct. To state this in numerical form, we discovered negative numbers. In all such cases, the numbers are represented by the negative sign to differentiate against the positive numbers or whole numbers that we already know. Yes, I remember reading about this in the book. Hmm. So, when we club negative number and whole number together, we form a new group called integers denoted by letter Z. Now, can we say that all natural and whole numbers are integers? Yes, we can. But we cannot say that all integers are natural numbers or whole numbers. Okay, and uh, why? Because negative numbers are not included in the set of natural numbers or whole numbers. So, we can say that all natural numbers are integers, but all integers are not natural numbers. Similarly, all whole numbers are integers, but all integers are not whole numbers. Hmm. Now it feels complete. Mm -hmm. Not yet. What now? <laughs> Milk? Hmm. Will half a glass be enough? Yes. Dada, hmm. I have a question. Hmm. What is it with numbers like 1 by 2, 3 by 4? Which group do they fall under? 
गुड क्वेश्चन सो यू टेल मी इट श्योरली वोट फॉल अंडर एनी ऑफ द ग्रुप्स वी डिस्कस अर्लियर ओके सो दिस काइंड ऑफ नंबर्स आर यूज वेन अ पार्ट ऑफ नंबर इज रिक्वायर्ड टू स्टेट वट इज दैट मीन इट मीन्स दीज नंबर्स कैन बी डिनोटेड एज अ रेशो ऑफ टू इंटीजर्स ओके इन द फॉर्म ऑफ पी अपॉन क्यू सच दैट पी इज न्यूमेरेटर एंड क्यू इज द डिनोमिनेटर एंड क्यू इज नेवर इक्वल टू झीरो नाउ टेल मी हाउ विल यू राइट हाफ वन बाय टू करेक्ट देन वॉट इज इट यू एड दिस ग्रुप ऑफ नंबर्स विथ इंटीजर्स देन दोज आर रैशनल नंबर्स वट इज रैशनल मीन द टर्म रैशनल कम्स फ्रॉम द वर्ड रेशो नाउ चैलेंजिंग क्वेश्चन फॉर यू हाँ वॉट डू यू थिंक आर ऑल नैचुरल नंबर्स होल नंबर्स एंड इंटीजर्स कैन बी कॉल्ड एज रैशनल नंबर्स Yes. Let's take any natural number. Say five can be denoted as five is to one, or any whole number like zero can be ne- can be denoted like zero is to one, or any integer like minus four can be denoted as minus four is to one. Absolutely right. And it is possible to denote all natural numbers, whole numbers, and integers as a ratio p upon q, and where q is not equal to zero. But then the question follows: Are all rational numbers are natural numbers? No, certainly not. Because numbers like one point five minus four point five, they're like not included in the sets of natural numbers. So all natural numbers are rational numbers, but not all rational numbers are natural numbers. Excellent. Ready at last. Thank you.